you while I'm uh, waiting for the um, those teeth to uh, cool down a little bit. Uh, uh, when the clay is sitting out like this, uh, most times I'll, I'll wrap it in plastic. That keeps the moisture in. But even then, you know, especially when, I, when it's uh, not as humid out, uh, you know, it starts getting a little too dry. So I'll break out the coffee filters again. And uh, I'll just start draping it. I uh, don't want to get it too moist. You get it too moist and you leave it on too long, uh, the clay is going to just start falling apart. So, um, you know, it's just a little uh, damp. Um, and you don't want to have it too damp either. Um, and God knows I've done enough times because if it's uh, too damp, um, you know, the, uh, the water's gonna drip all over the place and you don't wanna get water on the bottom. Um, so, uh, there, there I did it, you know, the water on the bottom, uh, that's gonna start breaking down the bottom uh, and it's just gonna end up being a mess. So, you know, I try and keep it, but, uh, the coffee filter's not too wet but covering the entire body so uh, and this is a continuous process from you know while I'm working in the wet stages of trying to keep it consistent you know always consistent uh, you know with um, so it starts get drying up you know, the shrinkage rates you know this is going to shrink um, I'm not sure what the percentage is uh, um, six percent you know from uh, wet uh, clay to uh, totally dry and if the difference in um, moisture is too much, that's where you'll run into a lot of cracking too. Um, so, okay, one more area. 